it's me, Becca. Wait a minute. I have an intro now. Hello, humans. Thanks for watching. It's me, Becca. I'm having a rough day physically. What? And I wanted to come out at you all and say hey, because I feel like we need this kind of authenticity in our world. I'm watching one of my favorite YouTube channels, How to ADHD, with Jessica McCabe. And today she was less scripted than usual and I love seeing that because it makes me realize that like she doesn't have it all together and I definitely don't have it all together and I appreciate seeing people when they are not feeling like they're together and like they're their public self. I think it's healing and helpful and healthy. So here I am not being all together and not being my quote unquote public self and let's be real here I kind of just don't have one of those very effectively anyway but like I'm cool with it. So yeah, right now, I'm having a day, man. What? I feel basically drunk. I'm not drunk. I'm, like, not under the influence of any substances other than, like, my normal medications. But chronic illness is such that it varies from day to day. And I have chronic illness and five kids and ADHD and grad school and trying to figure out how to communicate with people in ways that meet them where they are and are more considerate. And I'm trying to figure out how to juggle things and how to make a living and deal with nerves and just all the things. So I've got a lot going on, obviously, but so does everybody. But I just wanted to, to kind of share a thought right now while I'm thinking about it and I thought it could be helpful. I was talking to a therapist yesterday about depression and how like the fact that depression can often come along with chronic illness. And she told me that a lot of people have what I have and they're happy. Um, and I feel like I'm not going to her to get happier or to, like, accept my lot in life and have, like, peace with it. I actually feel like I am pretty at peace with it. Like, I have genetic condition, causes a lot of other conditions. Cool. So let's roll with that and figure out how to work with life. Like, I feel like I went to Chronic Illness Anonymous today and it's about, like, one of their main principles is, like, accepting your powerlessness and kind of surrendering to that fact, which is fine, and like, but they use the concept of like, I am powerless against chronic illness, and I accept that, and that's cool, like if that seems like it's really helping a lot of them, which is awesome, and I might go back, which is fine, but for me, that's kind of not my mindset that I particularly want to strive for. My mindset is more of, I am extremely powerful super effing powerful with chronic illness. I am barely able to function mentally or physically today, but I'm still making this YouTube video that maybe will be helpful for other people as well. And I feel like they get that, that saying, you know, like when life gives you lemons, you like make lemonade, sure. But I feel like instead of that, life has set me in a circus tent and then like threw a bunch of lemons at me and told me to juggle and I don't know how to juggle but like I can still kind of laugh at the ridiculousness of this situation oh and the circus tent is full of people by the way this is like during the performance and life said here's some freaking lemons you better learn to juggle them pretty quick actually you're already expected to know how to juggle them so juggle the dang lemons I don't know how to juggle lemons but that's fine like, I can sit here and be like, hey, everybody, I don't know how to juggle lemons, but I'm going to try to learn because that's what life gave me. So I'm going to juggle. And y'all can come and watch me learn to juggle. And I will do my best to be entertaining about that because that's helpful for me. And being real about it is helpful for me, too. So here's me in a circus tent full of people in the middle of the ring. And life has just thrown a bucket of lemons at me and told me that it's time for my act right now. And my act is juggling those lemons. And I am choosing to do my best to learn to juggle the lemons. I could just like sit there and not do anything or I could walk out of the tent or I could do any number of other things. I could try to make some lemonade, man. I don't have any water or sugar, so like that's kind of tricky, but you know, whatever. I'm resourceful, but my choice is to do the best I can to learn to juggle some lemons while I'm sitting in front of the audience and to enjoy the process. Maybe you guys in the audience can teach me to juggle the lemons. I don't know, whatever, but 
I think the main point I'm trying to make is that it's okay to not have your stuff together and to be open about that fact because I kind of feel like I don't know very many people who, who do really have their life together completely and they just like kind of don't don't put on that face in public because it's just kind of not what we do. But if you have a bunch of lemons that life is giving you or if you have a bunch of difficult circumstances or, you know, whatever, um, you're not alone in that. And I'm here and this video is me unfiltered and unedited and in bed because that is where I'm at right now. So if you are struggling and if you do not function the same way that society kind of wants you to function, then like, hey, you're not alone in that and you can be happy in that circumstance and still try to do what you can to work with it. I'm trying not to just full on surrender to the powerlessness of not knowing how to juggle lemons. I'm trying to balance learning to juggle lemons with just doing the best I can. And I'm cool with it. Anyway, like I said, having a having a day. My my body and brain are making me feel all weird and rambly and semi drunk, but I'm coming at you from from that angle and hope some of this is helpful. If nothing else, I hope seeing me in a state of being on a rough day is helpful. Thanks for watching. Goodbye, humans. Please subscribe, by the way, because that is a helpful thing for any YouTuber. And I am trying to get content out there that will hopefully be helpful to people without them having to do anything difficult to access it or pay for it. Thanks for watching.